Hey guys, it's John, and today we are playing Remothered Tormented Fathers. This is the closed beta version of the game. Uh, I signed up for it several months ago. I've been waiting for this game for literally years. It is a clock tower inspired game, so third person gameplay, stalkers, that kind of thing. And we're playing as this lady on the main menu. You are now caught up on everything I know about the game, so let's go ahead and just jump right into it. Hide yourself in the closets to avoid your enemies. Duly noted. So there is a disclaimer in the description that you can read. Uh, this is a closed beta once again, and there's a link to more information about the game, if you're interested, because once again, it is not actually released yet. I'm very excited about this. I. I've been following since maybe 2014. Uh, been following the game's development. There was a time when I thought it may not be released. I think that they had some trouble in the beginning. Maybe I'm making that up, but I do remember being worried that it, this game would never see the light of day. So it's cool to see it in a playable form. Taking a smoke break. Yeah, turn that shit off. I'm just kidding. I love all types of music. I'm guessing that's her daughter. Okay, I was waiting for something to happen. I didn't think that we'd get jump scared by the game's own logo. Surprise! It's in all red. Okay. Reach the residence of Dr. Felton. Okay, so uh, this is the game, cool. Looks really good for an indie development studio. Whoa, I don't think that's supposed to be floating right there. Is that her name tag? It became detached from her body. <laughs> oh wait, no, she still has it. It's just, it's there for some reason. Again, closed beta, uh, any bugs you see, will hopefully not be present in the full game. See disclaimer for details. Hi, can I read this? Oh. Missing since Thursday, October 14th, 1971. Last seen 4 p.m. at Recreation Ground. Uh, date of birth, February 8th. 1958, female, white, 13 years, light blonde hair, blue eyes, wearing a white dress with bows, white shoes, and tressed hair. Could that be us? 1958, right? Yeah, that could be us, right? Do you have blue eyes? Kind of hard to see. All right, so we got several different directions we could go. Let's go this way. I mean, I guess I could walk there, but we're kind of in a hurry, so if you don't mind. Not this way. Okay. <laughs> Not that way, huh? Okay, I should have just gone this way to begin with. It looked like the most official path. Ah. 
Dr. Richard Felton and Associates, Notary Study. Okay, we got uh, religious imagery here. Oh. Yes, hello. I'm Dr. Reed from the Santa Margarita Institute. I'm sorry, but Mr. Felton is no longer a patient. I know. This is why I'm here. Hello? Uh, anyone? Huh. I was not expecting that voice to come out of her body. I mean, I get it. Uh... She looks like she might have a deeper voice. Am I just going in? Am I just going in anyway? <laughs> Sorry. Fuck off. <laughs> Completed. Okay, well, we've reached the residence. Get inside the mansion and meet Dr. Felton. Okay, that doesn't seem like that'd be too hard. Just, uh... Just gonna walk right on in. Here I go. What, what's my name? I wish I could read my name tag. Yeah, it's too small to read. Okay. Like a greenhouse. Wow, who keeps up with this stuff? Surely not the good doctor. Sounds like he has like a secretary or something. Let's go in. Oh yeah, knock first. Hello? The gate was open. Are you there? Hello? Is anyone there? It's, uh, appears to be locked. So I guess I'll have to find a different way in. Maybe around this way? I wonder if there's like a creepy gardener that we're gonna meet. With shears, perhaps? Okay. There's a mower just sitting out. Wow, look at all these plants. Somebody's gotta keep track of these, right? Jeez. And roses too, lots of roses. Lots of flowers just in general. Carnations. Okay, let's uh let's try to get in this way. This looks like it might be the main entrance. Looks pretty grandiose. There we go. Well, what better thing to have around all these plants than something flammable? Yes. Good evening, Miss I Miss am... Reed, you already told me at the intercom, and as I already told you, Mr. Felton is no longer a patient at the Center of the I Institute. Know. I came here voluntarily. A patient? Outside the Institute. So what do you want? I am personally re-examining your case. Causes, reagents... I strongly believe there are alternative ways and probably other experiments that are worth a try. I am fighting with the Institute to recognize there are other adequate remedies for your husband's pathology. Oh, no, please. I I'm just assisting him. I'm his nurse. Uh, <laughs> I didn't know. Uh, it's okay. I suppose you want to talk to him. Thank you. I apologize for the darkness, but Mr. Felton's sight has been damaged and immensely compromised because of the disease. Anyway, I am Gloria. Oh, and please, refrain from smoking inside. Mr. Felton hates the smell of smoke. Sorry. He does, does he? I wonder if there's a story there. I wonder if there's a reason behind that. Alright, sorry about the cut there. I just turned the gamma up a little bit. I thought the game was a little bit dark. Please, this way. Oh, okay, am I following you? Sure, let's do it. Bad habit. Smoking? Yes, such a shame. You should quit. You have no idea how bad this is for you. 
Not only for your health, but it's also very expensive. Money and time wasted. Uh, it's not your business. I have so much to do every day. I couldn't waste time with such a bad habit. Okay. Do you well, assist Mr. Felton all day? Miss oh, no. Holier than From thou. From to 8 p.m. Then I go back home. I live near here. If needed, he can contact me with a pager, but that's not often. His wife takes care of him when I'm off. What can you tell me about her? I met her just a couple of times. She's usually out or locked in her bedroom when I'm here. Let's say they don't seem to get along. He and his wife don't I get along? No. But, you know, when she's home, she listens to the same music, the same song, over and over. Hmm. Interesting. The same song. I wonder if that's a song that I had on in, in the car. What if his wife is my daughter? I don't know. Just throwing it out there. Okay, is this it? This way, please. And Mr. Felton will be here in a few minutes. Okay. Just gonna snoop around. I mean, I'm down for it. I'll do it. I have no shame. It would be too easy, wouldn't it? I believe in people's willpower. Everything else is not God, but an aptitude or mankind's cruelty. This is the kind of fairy tale I prefer at my age. When you're worn out from an incurable disease, you start having some doubts. Why is there so much life in such small but lethal creatures? An arbiter, that's all we need. For what? It's wrong and crazy. It's human nature. That same nature in which we are equal to those ants eating each other. But, pardon me, I forgot my manners. Please, sit down. Dr. Reed, I suppose? <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Felton. Pleased to meet you. So, you already met Gloria? Yes, she let me in. She's a great reference. Extremely hardworking, but was that? back to us. Is I that don't like recall a seeing beautiful doctors like device? you at the Institute, Dr. Reed. <laughs> I am flattered, Mr. Felton. I arrived at the Institute just a few months after you left, and you left because... Inadequacy of the sanitary treatments within the structure. That's right. And in a few words... In a few words, they didn't know how to treat my case, and they left me there to die. But it seems that other issues took over. I once or twice refused to go through exams. Mr. Felton, is there anything I can do for you? Oh, Gloria, yes. See if Dr. Reed needs anything. Oh, no. May I offer you a cup of tea or coffee? Espresso? No, thank you. As you wish. How about you, Mr. Felton? No, thank you. I'll keep entertaining our guest. You can go now. You're diagnosed. 1958. Yes. Indicatively, some friends and I contracted the disease while traveling to mm. Egypt, and it got worse. In addition to the disease, the first exam showed some inconsistency. Some hormonal deficiency? Overdose of non-prescribed drugs, opiates? Anoxal? Wasn't it recalled in the myths of... Doctor, don't you think that nowadays there are ways to obtain drugs without any prescription? Uh, I believe so. According to your file, you still receive your disability pension. Even better, it seems that the beneficiary is your wife, Ariana Gala. Exactly. She's the one who takes care of me when Gloria is off. How about your daughter? My daughter? Celeste has never come back home. Disappeared. She was adopted. Oh, the I missing right? poster mm -hmm. at the beginning. Investigators confirmed that she intentionally left. They never suspected a kidnapping since 
there was no ransom request. How about Weeman? Wasn't he a suspect? A flash in the pan, an idiot who brought confusion by sending warnings and threats. And her birth parents? Dr. Reed, young girls often decide to just go. And this is what my daughter decided to do with... Jennifer. What did you say? At times, you'd call her Jennifer. No, my Mr. daughter... Mr. Fenton, what has really happened to you, daughter? I just told you! How about the off-the-record version? I am not sure where you're trying to go with this, but I won't tolerate... I don't have the strength for this now! I know you've been trying to forget her, but this picture might help you to... What is this? Where did you get this picture? Isn't she your daughter? Celeste, or as you called her? Jennifer? I asked you a question! The back of the picture says Jennifer. There is no Jennifer! Jennifer! You thought I was stupid, didn't you, Mr. Felton? Do you... do you really think I'd come here without knowing what I'm Who talking about? Who are you, and why did you come here? Did you come to my home to threaten me with your condescending Threatening tone? you? So maybe I should ask your wife then. She's not home. Seems like she is. Mr. Felton, I just talked to the director of the Institute on the phone. They have never heard of Dr. Reed. She is not what she claims to be. Well, Miss Reed. What? If that is your real name. Your time here has ended. Please, leave my property. Miss Gloria will escort you out. Please follow me. Mr. Felton, please, tell me what you did to your daughter. Good evening. Follow me. I'm not gonna lie, I lost track of everything that happened in that scene. Too many characters that we weren't introduced to. Too much plot that I wasn't privy to beforehand. You know the way. How do you even... How do I do what? How do you even sleep at night? You use people's lives regardless of the pain you cause. The Feltons have been through a lot. And they are good people. Gloria, a young girl disappeared. We all know the story, unfortunately. A burden that the Feltons will have to carry for the rest of their lives. Celeste just left them. If that was the case, there was a motivation behind it. And it threatened her life. I feel like I'm watching a soap opera right now. I I didn't follow like half of what was happening. So so that guy, closets are not always safe, especially if you leave the door half closed. Well, I'm going to close the doors all the way. So don't worry about it, okay? Anyway, so so that guy's daughter her name was Celeste, but he called her Jennifer. So she was someone else's daughter. I don't know. I don't know. Oh. Ha. We saw it from all the way over here. We've got an eagle eye. Okay. So we got the key so we can get back into the house. Great. Okay. Are we gonna get to play soon? I don't mean to be that guy, but... Okay, so we've completed our objective. Investigate on the disappearance of Celeste. Okay. Identify the source of the tune. Meet Mrs. Felton. Well, should we turn off the uh, power here? 
I feel like at some point we're gonna have to do that, right? Oh, nice. We have a flashlight. Cool. What's this? You picked up a defense item. Uh, okay. Interesting. A defense item. So, like, a weapon? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, if you press left button on the controller, you get to switch sides from left to right. That's cool. Okay, um, let's just search some drawers, I guess. Okay, well, I want to leave them open if I've already searched them. Anything? No, there's a candlestick. We could club someone over the head with that. There's a snow globe. You picked up a diversion item. Okay. So I can use that to, like, distract people, right? Okay. Keep, uh, keep walking around and look, looking. Uh, let's go in here. I don't want to run. I think that that makes more noise. And we probably have to be pretty stealthy. Towels. Okay, well. We don't need any of that. We're not going to be showering here or anything. Actually, I might be kind of wet from outside. I didn't exactly have an umbrella. Anything in here we could use? Ooh. Picked up a diversion item. And let's close it, because why not? Is there any way I could see? Okay, so this is my objective screen. Uh, what are... What are skills? Hang on. Oop. Can I click on skills? No, I can't go to skills or memory. Maybe they're not unlocked in the beta. Okay. Should we go in here? The door is locked. Okay. That makes sense. Probably couldn't be that easy. Can I crawl? Come on, look. Look, you can totally go under there. You just don't want to take the risk, huh? So many things to investigate. Let's check out uh, the cabinets here. Here. Here? Man, if anyone walks through this hallway, they're gonna know that I've been here. <laughs> I've opened up every drawer. Sounds like it could be coming from upstairs. Maybe in here? Really hope this music isn't in the YouTube copyright system. Picked up a defense item. So I got some scissors. Wait, 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 what's this? Press A to save the game. Oh, save. Cool. So you save at metronomes. That makes sense. Hold left trigger to restore life. Okay, so they're not only like a save point, but also like a healing spot. Oh, this is locked. This this goes to the plants on the other side, I think. I think I already went over here once before. Tales of Horror by HPL. HP Lovecraft. Wait, hang on. Picked up a diversion item. Okay, so I've got a snow globe equipped and scissors. Doors locked. You know what? That is totally fine. What is this? Who are they? Maybe some of Dr. Felton's distant relatives. Or maybe that's them. Maybe they've been, like, kidnapping young people to, like, suck the life force out of them. So they can stay young forever. Oh, I can't click that one. Oh, I can only hold one defense item at a time. 
I didn't realize that. I thought I was like collecting them. Okay, so do we go downstairs, do you think? Anyone here? I keep looking for like notes or something. Would be nice to have. Doors locked. All these locked doors. How does anyone get around in this place? Maybe I need something to use this. Okay, so we need to find like a key? We need to find a key. It did a bad job of saying that that's what we needed to do, but I'm pretty sure that's what we gotta do. Okay, we'll go back upstairs for now. We haven't even explored the second floor, so let's go up there. Oh, this is a hiding spot. Shh. Nothing scary is even happening. Stop it. Golly, she needs to calm down. What's that? Oh, it's a defense item. I think it's like a letter opener. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, it's a lot louder up here. Oh, is she up on the next floor, do you think? Or would you say she's over here? Sounds really loud over here. Right here? She scratched at his face a little bit. Yeah, they don't get along, right? This goodbye will be a chance to reach my land for me. What? Please, Mrs. Felton. <laughs> What is going on in there? So she's dead. She's been dead for a long time. Looks like it. Okay, well, let's hide somewhere. Let's hide somewhere. Let's hide somewhere. Let's do something. There's someone in the bathroom. Let's hide. Let's hide. Let's hide. Let's do something, please. What? You're just gonna drop me in? She wasted all the time. Hide, 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 hide. How do I close the door? How do I close the door? How do I close what the door? Happened, my dear? The record player got jammed again, right? Yes, I know. You, you keep on telling me we need to buy the new gadgets on the market. Promise, promise, promise. How can I say no to you? Now get some rest, love. He's got a hook. My little Jennifer. He calls her Jennifer. What? And then he licked her face. Wait, he called Celeste Jennifer. I just made the connection. She might have said that in the cutscene, but they were saying a lot of things. It's hard to keep up. Whew. By the way, uh, there are no subtitle options currently in the closed beta. When the enemy is chasing you, you can block the door behind you by using the left and right button. Well, I'm looking forward to that. Looking forward to being chased. Gonna be a great time. Gonna be a fantastic experience. Okay, well, let's... Try to escape from the mansion. And, uh... 
How do you propose? We're gonna do that. Look at all these mods. Why do the mods like her so much? She's been dead for a long time, dude. What was he doing in, in the... Did you hear him? He heard me. He said, who's there? I can't take anymore. You can't take anymore? We just got here. What? It's because I sprinted for like two seconds. Dude. How do I close- This house is not open to the public. How do I close this door? Oh, that was pretty easy. I'm sure it gets harder as the game goes on. How did he not see me? Please leave. Come on. I like just started playing. Get out of here. Get out of here. Leave. Leave. I just want to look and see what you were doing in the bathroom. Okay, I think he I think he left. Okay, shh. 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 What were you doing in here? Huh? Let's close the door. Close the door. Come on. What close the door? Eh. <laughs> Okay, what's this? Maybe I need something to use this. Try to remove the object stuck in the drain pipe. Okay, yeah, I'll get right on that. So what's this? What's this, raincoat? Check the pockets. Oh, we got a key. Did we get a key? Picked up the basement key. Well, where? Oh, I think I know. I think I know where that key goes. It goes to that door on the first floor that was like, I might need something to use this. So, okay, shh. Okay, so we checked, right? We found something. Should we go to the basement? What does, uh, what do our objectives say? Investigate on the disappearance of Celeste. Okay. Yeah, it's not, not a whole lot of specifics here. Let's, let's get going, dude. Did I hear somebody? Ah, nice, we got a flashlight on our person. What? Laundry chute? Maybe I need something to use this. Okay. Okay, I don't like that. I don't like what I just heard. Okay, shh. Very good, Dr. Reed. Turn that flashlight off. Think he's over here? No way, right? Surely not. So we should try to get out. Oh, where was that coming from? Okay, there's just... We don't need to crouch, but don't run for sure. Okay, the stairs were over here, right? Right. Yes. Okay. Good. What? What? Here we go. Here. Here are the stairs. Okay, let's leave. Well, uh, let's freaking get out of here. Dude, you better not be. What the oh, oh! I knew it. Fucking scary. Fucking scary. Ow, ow, ow. Run, 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 run. I like let out a squeal right there, guys. Sorry about that. Stop, you stupid bitch. Wow. Fuck you. 
Oh no 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 no! Ow ow ow! Run! Get out! Wait! Why is it? Why is it close? Try to escape from the mansion. Completed? What do you mean completed? Ooh! I used my defense item. Uh. Wait, what? How do we get on this side? I don't. I don't. I think that's a bug. That's a bug. That's a bug. And I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh boy. Once again, this is a closed beta. Um. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think it was supposed to teleport me to the other side. Is he about to pass? Yeah, he's definitely gonna walk past. Where did I put the damn pills? In the bathroom where you just came from. You should definitely go back over there and take them. Is he walking past? Should I get out? Okay, I'm just gonna assume... I'm gonna assume that we're done here. Yeah, because I think... Oh no, oh no, what was that? Okay, yeah, I think we're done here. Let's, uh... Let's continue. Need another what? Is he behind me? I think he's behind me. Okay, well we'll find out for sure in a second. I can't take any more. Shh! For crying out loud. Where is he? Do you think he, is he downstairs? He's coming up the stairs, isn't he? Oh my god, he sure is. I almost walked right into him. Good thing I hid. Put some freaking pants on, dude. Gross. You need another session? What do you mean you need another session? Okay, you, uh, you go get your pills, buddy. You go take care of that. Hopefully he's not coming back downstairs. Uh, this goodbye will be the chance to reach my land for me and then. Okay, he's up he's upstairs. Is calling us. He's upstairs, right? I'm going to the basement right now. I will see you later. Bye bye. This is it, right? This is the basement door. Where did I put the damn pills? Do I not have Do I not have a key. The door is locked. Are you... Do I... Basement key. I thought that that was where I used it, though. I'll wait for him to pass again. Yeah, I don't... I don't... I don't want to go up there right now. Yeah, 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 come on. Get out of the way. What? She was looking at me like I was doing something wrong. Stop it! Yeah, I hear him too, okay? Okay, let's go in here. Hey, we can go in here now. Cool. This was locked earlier. I'm guessing that this means that the basement door is down here then. It's gotta be. 
Oh. Where the? Where the hell? He's gonna come down here. Fuck. Door's locked. Um, is there a hiding spot here? Crap. Basement. Is this the basement? Oh my god. Why does it take you forever? Oh my god. All these doors are locked. Here. This. Yeah, you definitely should. And you shouldn't come this way. Can I just say that? Fuck. Oh, 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 oh. that was so close. That was so close. <laughs> where the, where the hell do we go? Where's the freaking, where's the freaking basement? So, I was talking to my friend Craven. And, um, apparently, what you gotta do is you gotta go to the menu and you gotta manually it. use the key! Stop. I hate you! I hate you! Go, go, go! You have to manually use it. I freaking. This is a really old school game, apparently. Oh, this door's locked. Shit! Oh. Get out of my way! Oh my go god! Away. I have a gift. You have a gift for me. Is it the gift of leaving me alone? Because otherwise, I don't really care. Just throwing that out there. Let's go back to our favorite place to hide. Right here. No, come on! You big bitch! How is he so he's so fast? Man, she is in shape. Yeah, I do actually. I do. Catch your breath, buddy. He like had to Dr. wipe. <laughs> he had to wipe his nose there. Did you see it? Get away with this. All right, we've been giving him the run around for a while now. Hide, 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 hide. Easy. This is my house. You cannot do this. I can do whatever I want. Okay, we gotta keep calm. Keep calm. Keep calm. No, don't go downstairs. Don't you need to take your pills or whatever? All right, so we're finally in the basement. Uh, maybe we can uh, search these drawers for something now. Seems like there are several laundry machines and the store is locked, of course. Because of course it is. Ah! So this is the laundry chute from the floor up. Gotcha. I'll take a screwdriver as a defense item. You'd think we could also use it for, you know, unscrewing things. Okay, we got a closet here. That's, that's useful. Fuck. I think I might want to use it like right now, right now. Because I think he just came down. Yeah, I think he did. He just... He just came in. You think he's gone? I think he's gone, dude. So, this door just goes... right back out. It's locked. Well, can I unlock it? And have, like, two ways to go in and out? Pretty gross. This is a gross shower down here. So what did I? 
What did I come in here for exactly? Ah, ah. Here you are. Who's playing around? Here you are. Oh! This house is not open to the public. Wow, he tossed me down the stairs. All right, we're good. Shit. Leave me alone, dude. Leave me alone. Okay. Oh, wow. I haven't been in here before. This is cool. Oh, shit. We're so dead. 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 Stop! Ow! Yeah! Get him! Yeah, does it make you mad? I could have run just now. Could have run, but, you know. Why do that when we can just take our time? Seems like we have some Shut up. This house is not open to the public. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I need to explore that kitchen, I think. Okay, I think the kitchen was over here. And there was a lot of stuff to find in here, actually. Okay, let's close the doors behind us so he doesn't get suspicious, like, oh, this door's open. They went in here, you know, that type of thing. Okay, so let's see, we got a book about apples, great. Maybe I need something to use this, okay. Um, oven mitts, I don't really know what you're looking for here. Ooh, a cleaver. Yeah, I think I will take that. Do you think he's coming in here? Oh my god. There's so many drawers to open. What if he comes in here? Crap. Oh my god. He's definitely coming in. I think I just heard him. Well, how? How can you possibly know that? The door's locked. This house is not open to the public. Don't come in here. I need another session. Oh my I god. Really need it. Yeah. Okay, then freaking leave and go get it or whatever. It's in here. Just gonna keep looking while he's here. You don't think he hears the drawers opening, do you? Oh. I think he does, actually. No? Old Crap, he's still in here. Oh no, he's on the other side. He's on the other side here. We're okay. It's just hard to tell sometimes with this game. Plunger. Okay. Picked up the plunger. Uh, sorry to rem sorry to interrupt. Crap. Where's my inventory? Tool consisting uh, in a rubber section cup with a stick attached. Used to clear blockages in drains and pipes. So we know what we gotta do with this, right? I think he's gonna explore down the first floor for a little bit. Hopefully. I haven't even been to the third floor yet, but we'll wait for that. Okay. I think we can run. I think we can run. I think it's fine. Okay. This way? Okay, let's go in here. Let's, uh, let's close the door. Leave things how we found them. And shh, crap. Okay. Seems like we have some company. 
Use the plunger. Oh, come on. Please do it faster than, than this. Making a lot of noise here. What? It's down in the basement. How do we get it? How are we supposed to get that out of there? Shh. Find the object dropped in the drain pipe. Okay, I'll work on that. Jeez. Is her head at any point gonna turn to face us? That'd be creepy. Yes, I do. Seems like we have some company. Oh my god. Would you like to play? No, I don't. This is not fun. This is not fun playing. Fun for you, maybe. Yes, go back upstairs. Oh, please. Oh, oh, did you see me almost turned around? Oh my God, what an asshole. Okay, I'm gonna save. Actually. Okay. I'm gonna save. Uh, that does it for part one. I need, like, a stress break. It's just... It's too much. But I'll, I'll get back to this uh, in part two. Let me know what you guys thought about part one so far um, of this game. I, I like it a lot so far. Uh, I do think there's a little bit of a pervasive stalker problem. Uh, kind of keeping me back from exploring like I feel like I should. And I think he's a little too alert, but... It is stressful, so I think that's kind of fun in a way. Um, still trying to figure out the story here. I think that the cutscene with Reed and Felton in his office was vexing, I have to say. I don't really understand the story. Like, is his wife actually, like, is her soul carry on through his daughter? Or like, there's gotta be some like eternal life plot happening, I feel like. Oh! <laughs> Alright then. Um, yeah, so let me know what you thought in the comments. And I'll see you guys in part two. Think critically.